hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel if this is your first time stopping by to watch my video you are highly welcome please do me a favor by subscribing to my youtube channel if you haven't done so already and when you subscribe click on the bell sign it will give you instant notification whenever i upload a new video and to all my old subscribers that keeps coming back to watch my video thank you so much guys for all your love and your support so guys in today's video i'm just showing you how i made this quick but delicious vegetable soup if you are interested to know how i made this mouth watery vegetable soup keep watching then let me introduce you to the ingredient that we'll be using let's get started <laughs> so guys over here i have a cow food and beef i have a washed shrimps diced liver blended bell peppers frozen spinach frozen water leaf salt palm oil crayfish or dry prawn red sliced onions and my cubes then in my pot i will start by adding the toughest meat i will add cubes sliced onions i added salt off camera so i'm just going to add water i will cover it and allow it to start cooking until it is 100 percent cooked so guys after some hours of cooking here is the meat is well cooked in my house if i cook meat and it's not well cooked my husband will not eat so i always make sure the meat is properly cooked so over here i'm just going to add a palm oil into the pan or into my pot if you are making vegetable soup endeavor to add generous amount of oil because vegetable soup needs a lot of oil so allow it to heat for a while when it is heated up i will add my sliced onions i'm just going to stir it now i will keep frying it until the onions becomes tender when it is fried enough i will go ahead and add the blended bell peppers in the blended bell peppers also i also blended the, a large bulb of onions in it but if you don't like onions you can just uh, skip adding the, the onions go ahead and blend just the blended peppers okay so i will keep stirring it until it is well fried to my preference after some minutes of frying the bell peppers uh, is fried to my consistency I will just go ahead and add my crayfish, I will add the shrimps, when I'm finished adding the shrimps, I'm just going to stir it then I will introduce the frozen water leaf. When I finish adding the water leaf, I will add the extra cubes because I'm making a large pot of soup, I will add extra onions again, I'm a lover of onions but if you don't like onions like I said, you can as well skip it. Then when you are done stirring it, you cover it up after some minutes again. This is how the soup is looking like at the moment. I will just go ahead and add the frozen spinach. You can as well use any spinach of your choice. It mustn't be the frozen one. I'm using the frozen spinach because that is what I have at hand. So when you are done uh, adding the spinach, go ahead and stir it. Mix it up properly so that the vegetable, which is the spinach, will be properly mixed into the water leaf or into the soup so at this point i'm just going to add back our cooked meat i will stir it up again so if you notice or you discover that the soup is too thick for you you can just go ahead and add a little drop of water or the water you got from cooking the stock of your meat if there is any so mix it properly until all the meat is well incorporated into the soup this soup just took me just less than 25 minutes to cook guys the reason is because that water leaf i showed you guys was the water leaf i stored in my fridge so it was just so easy for me to put together so guys after some minutes or some seconds of cooking because you know vegetable is not something that you overcook because you still want it to be so fresh and then after some minutes of cooking like i said you stir it up again and uh, that is it for this video guys this soup tasted so good like 
you can never go wrong with water living vegetable soup you know <laughs> you can just go ahead and enjoy this soup with any swallow of your choice i paired mine with plantain fufu and here is the final look of our vegetable soup if you know that you love vegetable soup you can just go ahead and enjoy this vegetable soup just the way it is without swallow but you can as well enjoy it with any swallow of your choice like i said you can use it with your rice basically anything you want to do with this vegetable soup you are free to do with it okay so guys that will be all for this video and please if you are new to my channel do not forget to subscribe and to all my old subscribers thank you so much guys for your love and your support please do me a favor by subscribing share this video with your loved ones and family until i come your way again with another interesting episode until then keep loving yourself bye